Hello, it's Chad Gillies from United, and I have the incredible privilege today of bringing verse of the day. Uh, and that verse uh, is 1 Samuel chapter 2, uh, verse 2, and it goes like this. There is no one holy like the Lord. There is no one besides you. There is no rock like our God. An incredible thing to confess, uh, an incredible thing to, to remind ourselves on. And, and this chapter is, is kind of called, uh, in some translations, Hannah's Song of Gratitude. And I think it's a really powerful thing. But in verse 2, uh, Hannah's really just kind of uh, reminding herself of who the Lord is. And I think that's something really powerful. I know for me personally, uh, waking up every day and reminding myself of who God is and what he's done and what he said he will do, it really actually stirs my faith and gets my perspective set up um, really to face the day or to face whatever it is uh, that I'm involved in. And, um, and I think that's a really powerful thing. When we, when we do make that comparison, when we personally say, you know what, this is what I'm facing today, or this is, what I'm, this is one of the things that I'm really struggling with, but you know what, when I compare it to, to, when I compare it to God, when I compare it to um, His faithfulness, when I compare it to the fact that He is a provider, when I compare it to the fact that He is the King of kings, um, it gives me perspective and I know that, uh, that really at the end of the day He's got my back. Uh, and the funny thing is stirring our faith is, um, is a responsibility that we have uh, personally. And so for me, um, I'm, I'm kind of reading this and I'm going, you know what, I'm reminded. I'm reminded of how God, good God is. I'm reminded about how holy he is. I'm reminded that no, no one else, no other God, no other figure, no other celebrity could ever compare to who he is. And the coolest part about the end is it says there is no rock like our God. We all know uh, when you compare something to a rock, immovable, uh, something that outlasts time. And I feel like that's a great way uh, to be encouraged this morning. So my encouragement to you would be wake up every morning and remind yourself of who God is. Remind yourself of what he's done. Remind yourself of uh, what he said he will do. And stir your faith and trust in the fact that um, he is who he says he is. And there's no one that compares to him. Amen.